Hello and welcome everyone, I'm your host John RMS, otherwise known as Ace Bullion, and today I have a special coin for you. It's right here. It's been sent in by Martin, the Silver Trader, so please be sure to check out the links down below under this video, and you'll, um, you'll find a link, of course, to his website, The Silver Trader. Uh, you'll find a link to the Precious Metal Forum, and finally, you'll find a link to my own personal website, Ace Bullion. So with that being said, let's find out what uh, this is all about, and uh, here we go. So first off, happy Wednesday again, um, and this is, well, an exciting coin. It's uh, the fourth coin in the series, and it's minted by the Royal Australian Mint. Um, anyway, let's have a good look and see. First off, we have Jody Clark's uh, design here on the back, um, and it's, of course, in uh, Memorial of Queen Elizabeth II. We have 1952 to 2022, obviously. And then we have the current year and one dollar. Now, it has a reeded or milled edge going all the way alongside of it, as you can see. And then we're gonna turn it over because I don't, to be fair, I've seen a lot of these already. I've already shown you. It's actually a rather decent you know, design, um, but it's the side that's gonna go face down. We've already seen these from the Royal Australian Mint. This side hasn't changed, um, but I'll show you there, just as you can see. There's Jody Clark's uh, signature, so you can see what you know where it is. Um, anyway, uh, this is of course the Australian Zoo Southern White Rhinoceros, and uh, there's a lot to actually you know share and show you on it. Um, as I said, it's number four in the series, and it is well, it's a stunning coin. Um, and going back, sorry, to the Queen's face, does have the denomination there is one dollar, hence why it's a coin. And there it is uh, down below. We have one ounce, three nines fine silver. And there's the white rhinoceros. Now you couldn't really tell whether it was white, black, green, or gray. Uh, at the moment, it's just quite silver. Uh, sadly, this is... Um, class as a potentially endangered species uh, despite there being about uh, 20,000 plus. Well, to be fair, 20,000 is not a lot uh, of anything really. So um, yeah, potentially endangered species, it's really sad. And you know, some of you may be looking and thinking, you know, why by the way, are there little tiny birds on that rhinoceros while I'm talking? Well, I'll get there. Um, out in the wild, the birds actually act as an alarm system uh, for the rhinos. So they have, the birds essentially get a, um, you know, the security from the rhino, the protection uh, from the rhino, but the rhino also gets an alarm system so that should anything happen in a distance or whatever, the birds will you know, immediately fly off, the rhino will start to know what to do, chances are it's gonna to spring to life just like that. Um, and well, <laughs> don't be in its way at the time. Let's, that's all I'm gonna say. We have immense detailing on the actual rhino itself. Look at it here. This is something that's super cool. You can see every nook and green, even the tiny hairs on the rhino's ear, ears, you know. Um, then you move down to its face, and you can see there its mouth, its nose, its eye, just spectacular. And then the horns, again, different uh, texturing going all the way through it. And then you have what I think actually the Royal Australian Man has done really well is, and I'm bouncing off the light there just so you can you know, see, obviously, get that highly reflective background all the, I forgot how close I'm zoomed in all the way through the bottom of the coin and uh, you have the initials AWB there uh, you know that's the maker sorry I couldn't actually find out the maker so if you do know who the maker is leave a comment down below I actually looked on uh, the Royal Australian Mint's website I couldn't find it I was on a few different websites and by now I should have it just written down I'm pretty sure um, 
But there it is. I mean, this is something that is spectacular and just everything about it. Um, the series itself is just a amazing little series and it's something obviously that those of you guys collecting it uh, will, you know, most definitely love. It's limited to just 25,000 uh, coins, which is more than the population of rhinos uh, out there. So that being said, <laughs> there's something for you. Um, and there it is. So I'd love to know what your thoughts and opinions are on this coin. Uh, apologies if this video is coming out later than it was, um, only because I was actually waiting on this package to arrive. So it will be, you know, uh, the video will be out whenever it's out. Um, so again, apologies. If you are waiting, by the way, on that Dragon Bar Coin review, uh, I know there's uh, a few of you out there waiting, me, waiting for me to be doing that. I do have it. Yes, okay, it is physically in my hand. Well, not right at the second. It's just off to the right to be here. Um, but uh, I'll, I will be doing that shortly. Um, Silver Trader has very limited stock. If you want one, contact them. Uh, but he will be getting, in fact, he is getting a lot more in very soon. Uh, the exact date when they're coming, I cannot tell you. So that's why I decided to do the Rhinoceros coin today instead of the um dragon uh bar coin so stay tuned that is definitely coming i could assure you of that um and there we are finally oh sorry one last little bit keep an eye on the precious metal form it's still growing rapidly and really awesome as well as my own personal website ace bullion uh, a lot of hard work and effort goes into all of those pieces so uh, again, if you like what you see, you know, please smash that thumbs up button, leave me a comment, let me know what's going on, and uh, I really do appreciate it. Anyway, without further ado, I shall say bye-bye for now, and I'll see you on Friday. Have a great week. Bye for now. Thank you.